I'm in Las Vegas right now at a Paris by Night taping of One of War, and look who I happen to see. Uh, we met him at one of the tweet ups in Little Saigon. So tell me, introduce yourself and tell me what is your big project here. Yes, hi. Uh, hi, Ted. My name, my name is Hong uh, Fan. I am the CTO of uh, New Face TV, uh, the newest and latest um, TV station uh, in the New York Vietnamese. And um, again, just like that, a fan of social media, a uh, uh, very big believer into that. So what I want to do is to try to promote using uh, technology and, and, and especially push forward into our new audience. Uh, we're looking for you know, younger and, 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 and more vibrant uh, audience of the future rather than just catering you know, music and, and things like that and entertainment. Uh, while we still can continue to do that, right. we want to expand more. Rising, especially you know, the young, young generation. Right, I know with the Paris by Night, it's such an artistic flair. There's so much going on with that. And like you said, you know, in the past, it's been really the entertainers entertaining the audience. But now our world has changed so much that people demand engagement. You see that with celebrities like Lady Gaga and Britney Spears tweeting and Facebooking with their followers and engaging like never before. How do you think that um, you know that will translate into the Vietnamese community? take you what we have now and make it even better. Yes, especially, you know, that is very, uh, I think one is you know, education or, you know, we, a lot of people don't uh, know yet that the power of social media, that the viral marketing, so you see that right now is still very uh, a narrow focus from the uh, content provider as well as producer as well as entertainers. Uh, some entertainers, they, they have their Facebook, they have their fan, but they don't want and they don't know how to export that. It's more of a you know telling story rather than promote their business and, and their, their fan base. So so that one of my you know duty is trying to educate them, put all that together, and make them you know see the value of of, uh, of social media, uh, viral marketing that, that really helps. It's just basically the, the PR, uh, free PR. Yeah, what are you yeah, doing? Absolutely. Do yourself and, and and especially the, the younger generation. Like again, I keep. The, Emphasizing on that, it's so important. That's the, the, you know, the newer uh, business model. Exactly. You, you have to cater to that. Because that's your audience, you know. Right. And it's so fitting that the theme of Paris by Night 104 in Las Vegas is beginnings. And it came from humble beginnings and just mushroomed into the largest Vietnamese entertainment worldwide, even larger than Vietnam. So it's really interesting that we have beginnings, and now it's an opportunity for you with Viet Face. TV to take the beginning and take it to another generation. So how does that make you feel, personally and professionally? I feel great because one of the things is just to kind of spread the, 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 the current technology into, let's say, an older audience, if you will, so they, they can you know, understand and also the younger audience will so wait for them, it take them to grab more fan base and, and that's the future business for them. And, and especially our young generation is very, very savvy on social media. So why not, you know, provide them or cater them exactly what they're looking for? And because they're very, very comfortable with that. So that I think is a great way. I feel great to to reach that gap between you know the old and the new. So tell me, who of, among the Vietnamese celebrities are using Facebook or Twitter pretty well? Name some of the singers that are using it really well. You get a little bit closer. Yeah, I, I think Kristi Sa is one of the, the, the pioneers, so she's very fluent on, you know, she, she's a, 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 journalist. a TV yeah. journalist personality, she's dope as well as singer, but she's one of the first ones that, you know, talk a lot about using her fan base and using uh, YouTube and Twitter, do everything around that, so I, I'm very impressed with her. Uh, the other very famous uh, entertainers, uh, uh, like Ken Han, mm -hmm. uh, she hasn't done enough, and I feel sorry for that because she's such a famous, you know, mm -hmm. uh, And she interacts so naturally with her fans, right? Yeah. So it's just yeah. a matter of sharing with them how to use the technology. Is, uh, that, exactly. is that the secret? That, that is secret sauce. Uh, so, so, and also not, you know, kind of, just, just use it in, in, into your benefit. And, and there's so many ways. And I keep talking to them. I keep, uh, you know, uh, discussing with, with them. And I say, you know, why not using it? So tell me some of the latest projects that you have uh, taking place in Viet Face. You know, can you share with us? Sure. Um, as you know that the, the Viet Face is is kind of a uh, a side project of uh, being a uh, Paris by Night. So, which is a producer of you know famous show you, you watch today, and, and it's, it's a brand name is recognized worldwide as far as entertainment. So what we we try to do now is that because of Viet Face, it's very narrow.
Yeah, we're focused on this community here in SoCal. North Cal and other, you know, part of the country not talking about, even though the brand name is recognized worldwide, uh, the broadcast capability right now is just only in the SoCal is out here. Uh, but beyond that, very difficult. So, so far they have to use some Galaxy uh, satellite dish, very cumbersome. So I'm working on a uh, very small uh, IP setup box, so we can from now on just deliver content directly on that. On that. So it would be streamed. So it would be really yes. similar to an Apple TV or Netflix. Exactly. So somebody can just stream all right. the different videos and the different selections. Correct. From the convenience of their home, they don't have to go anywhere to buy anything. Correctly and, and worldwide. And because of that, because we you know broaden the uh, the, uh, the audience, uh, of course we attract more advertiser. So we we make you know, the business model be more attractive. Us to produce better content, so you have to have revenue coming in to, to produce better content. So, so that's what I'm, I'm, I'm working on. It's going to be very inexpensive, uh -huh. a very tiny box. People just hook up your know, HDMI, get 1080p to their TV, very easy. If they have a broadband at home, turn on and voila. Wow. Uh, and 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 what we try to do ultimately is help them to sell the content such as DVD as we know so far uh, into a like you said a Netflix model mm -hmm. with just streaming so we can avoid you know pirate we can mm -hmm. avoid you cut those costs to make a better content wow. to our audience. Well, that's exciting. So where can people find Facebook uh, I'm sorry via Face TV on Facebook and on Twitter? Yeah so the, the easiest way is to, to go to get facetv.com that where is the, the gateway to to, to, to to branch out and on that website, you can uh, watch uh, 24 hours live streaming, number one. Number two, we're going to put the latest information, and as well as on the right-hand side, you will see the uh, Twitter and Facebook and everything, you know. Uh, just click on that, and, and, and you will you will get right there. All right. Okay. So all you out there watching, you know, make sure to like Facebook TV and also follow via Face TV on Twitter as well. So thank you so much for talking okay. with me. And it's so great because uh, I remember meeting you at a tweet up in the Little Taiga and the Fall restaurant. So we've been yeah. friends ever since. So thank you. Thank you. All right.